What's stopping you from turning your ideas into something real? Sometimes it's not a lack of knowledge. It's time, focus, not knowing exactly where to start. As a new developer, I used to get overwhelmed by trying to do everything the right way. Full stack, from scratch, perfectly optimized. But the truth is, you don't always need all that to build something useful. What if I told you that one of the most helpful tools in my day as a developer is a timer? Specifically, a Pomodoro timer. It's a method that helps you stay focused by working in short, timed bursts with breaks in between. It sounds small, but it helps you avoid burnout, get into flow, and actually finish the things you start. And as a new developer, or just as a human being, I struggle a lot with being focused. I would either spend hours tweaking the tiniest CSS bug or lose motivation halfway through my side projects. So I decided to build something for myself, a custom Pomodoro web app tailored to how I work. Now you might be thinking, isn't this a coding channel? Shouldn't you be building this from scratch? Well, here's the thing. Sometimes, especially when you're still learning, you want to bring your ideas to life without getting stuck on setup, hosting, or endless bugs. And that's where Hosting Your Horizons comes in. Hosting Your Horizons is an AI-powered, no-code web app builder that takes your ideas to a fully deployed app in just minutes. No coding, no backend setup, no configuration headaches. It's perfect when you want to stay in flow and just build. So in this video, I'll show you exactly how I created my own Pomodoro web app with hosting your horizons. From AI-assisted creation to customizing the UI to launching it live with one click. It was designed to let anyone turn their idea into a real working web app without the usual technical roadblocks. I was skeptical at first, but also tired, so I gave it a try. I typed in something like build a Pomodoro timer that lets me customize work and break sessions and has a pastel color theme. And within seconds, literally seconds, it generated a working web app for me. Let's see how it turned out. First of all, it is super cute. It let us customize our focus and break duration so we can tweak the work session minutes, the short break, the long break. You can adjust literally everything and you can see your session progress over here on the screen. And you know what really surprised me? Hosting your horizons lets you export the full project as actual code. Just by clicking a button on the top left, I was able to download a complete vid plus react plus tailwind project with clean folder structure, JavaScript logic, everything. If you're a developer like me, this is gold. Even though Hosting Your Horizons is a no-code platform, it's not a closed box, you're not locked in. You can build your MVP quickly with AI, and when you're ready to go deeper or want full control, just export the code and keep building locally. That means you can add your own database, tweak the logic, or even connect to external APIs, whatever you want. This is huge if you're someone who loves coding but doesn't love boilerplate or setup. Instead of starting from a blank canvas, you start from something that's 80% done and just refine it. The only thing to keep in mind is you can't directly edit the code inside Hosting Your Horizons. If you want to change how something works visually or functionally while still on the platform, you need to prompt the AI once again, which honestly is part of the fun. You typed in what you want and the builder just does it. But once you export it, it's yours. You're free to customize it however you want using your favorite stack. And this is especially great for new developers. You can learn by reverse engineering, understand structure, see how the AI interprets your prompts and turn that into real code. And even use that as a foundation for learning best practices. And let's be honest, building with Tailwind, React and Vit as a dev is a dream combo. I use that on my personal projects almost every single week and seeing them right up in the export felt like a head start. I was honestly shocked. Then came the fun part, tweaking the front end, my favorite part. The only issue here is how it is not centered. There's definitely one div wrapping the three main components of the page and they are centered, but since the first one is bigger, the main one, which is the timer session, it's not exactly in the middle of the page. That's bugging me a little bit. I'm regretting asking for a pastel colors because I, I think vibrant colors would be better, but we can adjust that within seconds again. We just need to prompt the AI again and ask 
for these little changes. Instead of pastel, I want the website to have a vibrant gradient color, such as purple, pink, and blue. Maybe some black, but it has to pass a relaxing vibe. I need the session progress to be centered in the middle, like the title and the footer. And now we just wait. Oh my god, I'm literally so shocked because this is exactly what I had in mind when I thought about doing the Pomodoro timer. This is so good. Let's check the preview. I love the vibrant colors. That little thing is not in the middle anymore. But I guess if we just remove this third image, we can make this work perfectly. It was the first time I truly felt like I had control over a project without spending hours setting it up or losing my mind over it and stressing out so much. I'm gonna ask for a little tweak in here. Since it says with a touch of cosmic calm, I'm gonna ask to put stars in the background instead of this picture of a galaxy as the third component of the page. So then everything is gonna be in the middle and I think this image isn't necessary. So I'm just gonna ask that. I'm literally so excited for this. Oh my God, this is perfect. Let's open the preview and see how it looks. This is literally perfect. Now, this is what I'm talking about. Hosting your horizons, you are amazing. So let me give you a tour through the Pomodoro Focus. Elevate your productivity with vibrant, customizable focus and break sessions. Find your flow and conquer your tasks with a touch of cosmic calm. And then we have the stars falling in the background. Tune sessions. Craft your perfect productivity rhythm. You can change the focus time. I'm gonna pick 30 minutes. Short break, I'm gonna put 10 because five is not enough for me. And my long break is gonna be 30 minutes. And then we can start. Broken session started. Focus time, 30 minutes. This was the easiest thing I have ever done in my entire life and it turned out amazing. How can you not love hosting your horizons? Excuse me, cause I'm on focus mode right now and I gotta work. Once I was happy with the look, I clicked publish. And that's it. No GitHub actions, no domain setup nightmares, just one click and it was online. Yes, it was that simple. Hosting your horizons gave me a live link instantly. Mine was something like plum slash turkey, which yes, sounds like a quirky indie game, but it worked. I could access my website from anywhere and share it with friends right away. No deployment process, no build errors, it just said published successfully and boom, it was live. But here's the cool part, they also give you the option to connect your own domain. Right after publishing, there was a get domain button, and honestly, this is where it started feeling like a real product. Having your own .com adds a whole new layer of professionalism and credibility. I ended up picking pomodoro slash focus.com, which I registered directly through Hosting Your Horizons. No need to go to another registrar or a mess with DNS records, it was all handled in one place. And they have a bunch of extensions options too, .com, .net, and even fun ones like .space. If you already have a domain, you can link it. If not, you can search for one right there and register it instantly. This step alone made the project feel legit. And if you're building a portfolio, a side project, or even just testing an idea, having a branded domain name helps with SEO, discoverability, and even building trust with your users. And it's live right now. Please check it for yourself. Go to pomodoro slash focus.com and you can also use my new Pomodoro timer. And thank you so much Hosting Your Horizons for sponsoring today's video. This no-code website builder, it's just... What's even cooler is that Hosting Your Horizons isn't just for this one project. It's an all-in-one solution. I can manage my hosting, domain, and even email all-in-one dashboard. That really helps me stay focused because I don't need to waste time jumping between platforms. Plus, if you ever get stuck or have any questions, they have a 24-7 support team that is super helpful, available in multiple languages and it's completely risk-free, you get a 30-day money-back guarantee, so you can try it out with zero pressure. If you feel stuck between tutorials and real projects, try building something small, something dumb, 
something personal. You don't even need to overthink it. Just describe it and let the AI do the rest. Then you go in and put your style on it. So my advice is start building. So if you got a project idea, whether it's a Pomodoro timer, a portfolio, or literally anything else, get started today with hosting your horizons and use my coupon code there she codes to get 10% off your first month. Links in the description. Go turn your idea into something real before your coffee gets cold. And I will see you all next week.